the narcissist is not who you think they are. When you are beginning to move on from the narcissist, because of the false self that they displayed, the manipulation and the illusions that they portrayed to you, you might wonder if maybe there was more to them than what they displayed to you. Maybe there was something that they were withholding. Maybe there was something that they didn't give to you. The narcissist will play on your cognitive dissonance. They will manipulate you and give you illusions to try to make you believe that there was more to them than what they gave to you. There was something else that you didn't see or didn't get to partake in. Something that they want you to think that you were not worthy or deserving of. Something greater than what they had displayed to you. I can assure you that everything you got from the narcissist, everything you got from your interactions or engagements with them was exactly what they had to offer. And it was all that they had to offer. There was nothing else. The lying cheating and stealing, the dishonesty and deception, the abuse and manipulation. That was everything that they had to offer to you. When you are moving on from the narcissist, they might try to trick you into believing that you are missing out on something. They might try to trick you into believing that they had more to offer you. They might try to make you think that there was more to their personality or character. But that is just another one of their lies. Another one of their manipulation tactics. What you receive from your interactions or engagements with them was exactly what they are about. It doesn't develop into anything greater. But sometimes you can become fixated on the possibility that maybe there was something more to them. Something of value or importance. Something worth going back to. But there isn't anything more than what you got from them. They were not withholding this extremely beautiful, elaborate or impressive side of them that you have never seen before. They were not keeping some amazing personality to themselves. The truth and the reality of the situation is that everything you got from them was exactly what they had to offer. You need to detach from the thought or idea of there being anything greater with them. There is no greater development or outcome than what they display to you. There is no other alternative to them. No other form or version than what they show to you. There is nothing there that is greater than what they have shown you. The person that you saw, the personality that they reveal to you, that's really all they've got. It's like they gave you a preview. They gave you a trailer 
of what you might desire or expect to see from them. But then, when you actually go to watch the movie, it's not as great as they had led you to believe. And those of us who stick around for the ending of the movie always leave feeling disappointed or dissatisfied. It ends in a way that fails to fulfill your hopes or expectations. You give your money to watch this movie. You give your time and money to this relationship. And once it's finished and the credits start rolling, you realize that you just wasted your time and money for nothing. It's the same thing with a narcissist. Once the movie is over, and the credits start rolling, it's over. There is nothing more to it. But then you look at the narcissist and think that there must be more to them. When the relationship is over, you think there is just no way that's all there is to them. There must be something more something greater but the truth and the reality of the situation is that that's really all there is to them and there there is nothing greater that they have to offer if they had anything greater they would have given it to you Everything you saw from them, everything that you experienced in your interactions with them, it was a part of their personality and character. It was a part of who they really are. They displayed it to you. There is nothing more to uncover or to be revealed. And they are fully aware of this. They know that they have nothing more to offer you. Which is why they will then move on to someone else. Someone who will be more susceptible to their manipulation. Someone who will believe in their illusions and lies. They are not going to stick around to defend anything. They will defend their image. But if you don't believe in it. If you're not going to validate their image, then there's nothing more to be said. There's nothing more to talk about. Because when it comes down to having good character, they know that's something they're not. They know that's something that they cannot defend for. Because what they display to you is exactly what they had to offer. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonates with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. Click the bell icon to receive notifications for my future videos. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in, is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at narcsforthecoaching at gmail.com. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.